My name is Barry Graham and I'd like to spend just a few minutes introducing the TM Forum Information Framework. The framework is part of our complete business suite of best practices, standards and models, collectively called frameworks. You'll often hear it being referred to by its former name of SID, which is an acronym for Shared Information and Data Model. The framework started out as something used primarily by telecoms operators, but it's now grown to encompass the entire enterprise of any digital services based business. The framework can be thought of as a common model and language for the information needed by all the processes in the business process framework. This information is arranged into aggregate business entities or ABEs, which represent logical collections of things a business is interested in. These are then structured into domains, just like the other frameworks. The information model describes both the entities, their attributes and the relationships between them. People use it in many different ways. Firstly, it's a common language that can be used between companies, departments or teams when they're discussing the processing of business information. It's also often used for defining requirements for specifying and integrating IT systems. And conformance with the information framework is a key enabler of interoperability, not only within a business, but between businesses. Although it's closely coupled to the business process framework, it's often used independently of it. And as the use of the TM Forum APIs increases, then the information framework provides a vital top level reference model for individual API data models. There are a large number of case studies available on the TM Forum website so that you can see how it's helped a range of businesses improve efficiency, reduce costs and drive up customer satisfaction. If these inspire you to see how the information framework could benefit your business, you might like to look at our other resources, including online training courses, where you can learn how to use it in practice. The information framework is collaboratively developed by members sharing their best practices. It's been constantly evolving. And right now, the focus of this work is on adapting to the changes occurring across the digital services marketplace as virtualization technology moves from the lab to real business scenarios. Examples of this evolution include supporting the challenges of modeling virtual network functions and resources alongside existing traditional network appliances operating in a hybrid network environment and the models needed in the trend towards catalogue driven operations. If you're interested to get involved in this cutting edge work and your company is a member of the forum, then go to the collaborative R&D section of our website to see how you can join the project and get involved. If your company is not yet a member, then look at the membership section on the website or contact us to find out more about joining the forum.